All I have to tell my people right now is this. Listen, when it gets tough, the tough gets going, okay? And we're all going to have to be going through all different kind of measures that we never saw coming in order to make things better. It's going to be a long while before everything gets back to normal. This headline that I saw from the Gleaner that says, Heartbroken. Jamaican ship workers were denied landing in Kingston yesterday and I went on to read and it started off by saying they came so close Some reportedly became emotional broke down just started crying because them see them yard right there so and them can't go there It was the first time in 21 days that a group of 45 Jamaican ship workers aboard the Marcella Discovery 2 were seeing land and it was capital city Kingston can you imagine welcome to Jamrock a plane of their mind and they're thinking yes I'm finally gonna go home and then you're denied landing can I come in after being out to sea for 21 days wow people are get seasick on them something there but I mean, in, 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 in spite of all that's going on, so the story went on to say, but with restrictions on incoming passenger traffic because of the something we are going on right now, getting on the vessel was next to impossible. And it appears their plea for exemption would not be answered. That was a day after the vessel anchored in Kingston refueled, waited for hours for docking clearance, and then left. Reportedly after no response came from the government. The government said what they said, and they meant what they said. You're not coming in, no need to talk about it. Damn, Andrew. And who can blame them right now? You see what's going on? Who can blame them right now? Could Jamaica really stand? Taking in 45 people right now. I know it's, it's messed up because this is the only place on earth that should never ever be able to turn you away. Do y'all understand what's going on here? These are immigration matters that in some ways are being violated because I've said it. I've said it. The only place on earth that cannot turn you away is the place where you were born birthright citizenship land cannot turn you away where else they're gonna send you to on earth huh where else would you have more right to be other than there hey, can you imagine that being turned away hey you gotta go you can't come in but I'm a yard I honestly think that there should be a measure put in place where they take them in 45 of them they quarantine them for two weeks whoever is sick get treated who isn't let them go that's their home birth home 45 of them got turned away denied landing all Jamaicans in the Dominican Republic as dozens of workers disembarked the pain became more for the Jamaicans because the Dominican Republic took in their people because where else are you supposed to send them? people answer me, answer me in the comment section below I understand all the precautions we're taking but you can't just leave your citizens out to sea what, are they expecting them to stay on that boat until this all blows over? Or that ship reality is starting to kick in because we are now on our way to Europe they were told oh my goodness Europe really Jamaica have about 50 something cases of that thing there and I refer to it as that thing that everybody know what I'm talking about I'm just tired of hearing the word Jamaica has about 50 something cases. You sending them to Europe? Europe! Europe has thousands and thousands of cases. And depending on what part in Europe they, they land, they're going 
into a full blown storm of this thing. So I can't imagine the fear. She said that the captain was willing to return to Jamaica with her countrymen once there was clearance before the ship hit the Atlantic, but they never got the call from local authorities that they prayed for. So the captain was willing to turn around, carry the ship go there, just for them 40 Jamaicans and say, 45 Jamaicans and say, okay, listen, go, okay? I'm fiddling with my computer screen here, people. And the captain did his best and took them back. They just did not get accepted. They sat and they waited, they refueled. Now these Jamaicans, right, are facing uncertainty about their future as they head to Portugal, where they will be among hundreds who will have to disembark there in another week. So they've been at sea for 21 days already. Now it's going to be another whole week before they see landing again. And then when they disembark, it's going to be in Portugal. According to Daily, the worry has intensified for the Jamaicans who now must begin to make their own arrangements for their safekeeping in Europe and eventual return home. Wow. I feel like these people are being punished, man. So it is now their responsibility to make their own safekeeping in Europe. Do they have enough money for a place to stay? Do they have enough? Do they have any friends, any relatives? This is a time when they're probably going to have to band together as brothers and sisters. It's a shame. But you know what this thing is doing? This thing is forcing us to realize that we are more connected than ever before. This thing is forcing us to realize that in numbers we have strength. This thing is forcing us to realize that we can work through things that are hard and even seeming impossible. If we stick together put our resources together, put our resources together, and that's a one. They're gonna be dropped all the way over in Portugal, and then they'll be left there to fend for themselves. According to Daily, the worry has intensified for the Jamaicans who must now begin to make their own arrangements for their safekeeping in Europe. In other words, they have to make their own arrangements for somewhere to stay and eventually return home. And of course, they won't be allowed to return home until people are allowed back into the country again, however long that might take. So if you don't have enough money to save up right now, you're gonna be depending on somebody I don't know. This sounds such a desperate, this sounds so desperate. So basically, we will be left out in the cold then, she said. Adding that at least two other countries have indicated that they will send charter flights for their natives who work on the very same ship. Her only consolation at this point is that for the weeks the ship has been at sea, there has been no cases of this thing away at Baron. When I said this thing I will go around, y'all know what I'm talking about, right? Foreign Affairs Minister Karima Johnson Smith could not be immediately reached for a comment on whether the government would be seeking to help the Jamaicans in any way. Of course not. Meanwhile, it has been a nerve-wracking few days for Alicia Scott. Another Jamaican on the Marcella Discovery 2, the same ship, now heading to Lisbon. All in place that we never know. I'll have to go Google that. The pandemic is mostly over on that side. And nobody really wants to go there. She said it's mostly over there. It's a big breakout over there. And nobody really wants to go there. She said that 
nothing that the Jamaicans were willing, she said that noting that the Jamaicans were willing to go into quarantine if they had been allowed to disembark in Kingston. They just want to be home. I'll come home. Lock me up when I get home. I don't care. But they weren't allowed landing. I, I, I don't think that's good. Because what is the Jamaican government going to do? What kind of compensation is going to be handed to their family members? And I say family members because this thing is serious. So if they go, for instance, all the way over to um, some place in Europe, Lisbon, wherever, and they end up getting sick and dying, how is this going to be handled? Wow. Europe with hundreds of thousands of cases of this thing we are going has been the new epicenter for this thing we are going Although over the weekend, there were reports of a slowing in the number of infections and fatalities, they still have hundreds of thousands of cases. That, however, is cold comfort for Scott. It's like they refused us, she said, referring to the Jamaican government. I cried for days. Kimono Hansen was similarly worried. She wants the Jamaican government to help make arrangements for the ship workers to get back home or get to the nearest port if a return is not possible at this time. Not all the rotted way over in Europe somewhere. And they were willing to go into quarantine. Right now, the Jamaican government is running down looking for 500 and something people who they think needs to turn themselves in and very well might need to go into quarantine. And not one of those people are showing up to them. And 40 plus Jamaicans showed up willing to go into quarantine and they turned them away and are sending the people all the way over to Europe. That not sit good with me. If I was on that ship, I'd be pat yo, me that me that jump off, you know? Me that jump off and swim, they would have to lock me up in Jamaica. At least I would be in Jamaica. Where you are sending me go all the way to Europe for? I'm right here, I'm home. I'm not a runaway. I was working. I was out to sea. I've been out to sea for three weeks, 21 days before Missy Landing. And now you telling me I gotta go back, stay on that ship and go for another week. I'd be a whole month at sea. And then go to one of the places in the world that has the highest numbers in this thing that we are going on. Oh man. I personally don't think that this was dealt with properly. Anyhow. Leave your comments in the comment section below. I'd like to hear what you think about this one. And please do not use the word P for an with them and ik. And don't use the other word. We we'll start with the C. Whether it's the first name or the second name, we we'll end with the 19. Be creative in how you say it about that thing that we are going around. Okay? If you're going to use those words, I'm going to disable the comment section every time. I've already explained to y'all what's going on with YouTube and the use of these words and our videos. People still I use the word anyway. That means I don't care about the people in channel. Don't use the word. I'll catch y'all on the next video. I'm out. Hey, let me tell you something before I go. Now is the time that we will realize who's really about their people. Now is the time that we will realize who is really their brother's keeper, their sister's keeper. Now is the time that all the vindictiveness will come out. All the hate will come out. Also, all the good qualities from good people will shine now. Keep your eyes peeled. See who is who. A virgin of mine said, after this is done, 
your friends list should be extremely shorter and only the thoroughbred, well-tried and proven ones should remain on it. I'm out. Peace.